Yo, what's going on ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another Minecraft video. Here today guys, we're going to be showing you a XP glitch for Minecraft Bedrock Edition, the latest version. So with that being said, let's get right into it. Now before we do that, we'd also just like to ask you to please subscribe to this channel, share this video with all your friends, like, and uh, any glitch enthusiasts, you know, just share this video and they may enjoy it. And once again, hit the notification bell, but with that being said, let's get right into the video. Alrighty guys, so we're at the location of the glitch. Now, uh, before we get down to it, we do need to clarify some things for you. So the voice that is talking right now is me, the guy who normally does the videos. And I currently, uh, due to some lockdown issues, it, uh, I cannot record the video. So we're actually joined by Scooby. He will be recording the video for all of us today. So thank you, Mr. Scooby. So I'm just going to give you a quick little sundown of how this works. And then you're going to be watching on his screen on how to actually do it for yourself. So uh, what we have here are two contractions of two furnaces right now. So uh, this actually has to do with Smelton. Now we'll show you why uh, Smelton right now. So uh, uh, for instance, um, if you look into this furnace right now, this is just an average furnace with some stone smelting up. Now this could actually be any um, items you want to smelt, uh, anything that you can smelt to get XP for instance. In this case, we're going to be using stone because it works uh, pretty well. So uh, this is an average furnace, nothing too weird about it. Obviously we have the coal in there, we have some cobblestone, and it is smelting to make us some smooth stone. Now if we were to take out some of our stone there you will actually see that it gives them um, an okay amount of XP you know nothing too crazy so we're gonna look at what um, the amount of XP that one cobblestone gives us just for a little bit of clarity and some uh, back uh, background information that we can compare to so that is uh, one smooth stone from the furnace right there and you can more or less tell how much XP gives it by looking at the hotbar on Scooby's screen. So now what we have here guys is a contraption that we like to call the super duper XP giver. Now what this allows you to do is get a lot more experience from basically the same process and we're going to show you how. So what you need to do right is have yourself a furnace attached to hopper at the bottom and then a chest or attached to that. Now obviously the top uh, hopper is optional you do not need it it's up to you so we just put it there to uh, allow um rock to go into the furnace automatically so you don't need it you can obviously just go into the furnace and put in the stone the cobblestone for yourself or whatever item you plan to do this with so it's, it's your choice if you want the hopper at the top or not so then what you guys do is you make sure that you put your um obviously you put your item that you're going to be smelting at the top your coal or your fuel source and then just allow it to smelt up then what you're gonna need is a hopper now what you put in this hopper is whatever item you intend to be smelting with like we said we intend to do smooth stone so you obviously for us we need cobblestone and uh in this case we need to put smooth stone at the bottom fill it up with this type of thing that your smelter device is going to be pooping out there in the furnace so like we said for us it's smooth stone so we're going to have smooth stone in our hopper. For you, maybe it will be iron ingots. So obviously you will have at the smelting area iron ore, which will be iron ingots in the furnace area. And then obviously in the hopper, it will be full of iron ingots if you get what I'm saying. Then at the bottom chest, guys, you need one stack of whatever your furnace poops out. For our case, it is smooth stone. So we have one stack of smooth stone. Then the rest of the slots, you can fill up with any other block. It doesn't matter. But here's the catch, all right? The more blocks that you have filled up with whatever source you have, for instance, as smooth stone, the more slots that are filled up with smooth stone, the more XP you're actually going to get. In this case, we only have one slot filled up with smooth stone, but if we were to fill up all the slots, we'd get even more XP. Obviously, this just, just depends on how much of the resource you actually have to use. Okay, so first note how much XP I have currently in my hot bar. And next, I know that in the furnace there is more um, stone than necessary, but it should pile up the XP. Okay, so... Now I'm at two and more than two and a half um, bars of XP, but the next one that cooks up should give me roughly about half an XP bar. Yep, now I'm at three and three quarters, basically. We'll do it again. 
Nearly five. And again. Nearly six. Okay, so now we are going to try it out with three stacks full at the bottom and obviously the rest will just be any type of block. In this case we're using dirt, but you can use wood or sand, it doesn't really matter. But now we're going to be testing out this glitch when you have more of whatever you were smelt. Let's just call it your smelt profit in the bottom chest and we'll check how much XP we get now. So right now we have three stacks, earlier we only had one stack in here. So let's see the difference in the XP we get from the contraption. Note that I have nearly six levels. Now it get it now I have a six and three quarters basically. So now as you notice it, like of course it's gonna be harder to get more XP as your levels go higher, but it's still pretty effective. And obviously if you filled up the chest at the bottom with the maximum amount of slots of whatever your profit's gonna be, in this case it would be smooth stone, then you'll get even more XP. But keep in mind, as you get more XP, it's gonna be harder to get XP. So that's why you may notice a bit of drops. But you're actually still getting a lot of XP. And if you were to, let's say, let, maybe let's kill Scooby and just quickly check how much levels he'll get from the first go. Trying it out with three stacks. Okay, so now he's got no levels, so let's see what the Prophet gives him now. Okay, so now obviously you can tell, because we had less stacks piled up in the furnace, it obviously didn't give us as much XP, but we only had about one or two in there. And it gave about two levels, which is actually a lot. Take note that we only had about a couple blocks in the furnace. So just take a look at what he's doing now, right? This is obviously three stacks, and obviously you would get more XP if the stacks were filled up more with smooth stone or whatever ever it is. In your case, it could be iron ignis, gold ignis, it's your choice. Whatever you can smelt to get XP. Now, once again, since you can take a look at what's happening with this contraption, we're going to compare it one more time to the average run-of-the-mill furnace. So let's quickly kill Scooby and check out what XP he can give us. So now for comparison, take a look at the normal furnace. Now I have no levels and if I take out on this furnace, I get no levels at all, no XP at all. You can try again one more time. Same thing, nothing. So in the end guys, we can more or less conclude that by doing this, you get a lot more XP. Now I know this video maybe will be a bit confusing, but we'll try to explain it. And hopefully at the end of the video, the editing in that will make it uh, understandable. But if you have any problems, we know you guys may encounter So just comment down below, and it'll do our best to help you. We've done enough testing to see that it does work. You have seen it with your very own eyes. But if you have any questions, comment down below. And once again, all you need is a furnace attached with a hopper and a chest. And obviously you need to fill the bottom with whatever your smelting profit is. And obviously the hopper has to be filled up with your smelting profit. And in this case, we were smelting cobblestone into smooth stone. So that's why everything is filled with smooth stone at the bottom parts. And once again, the top part is just for decoration. You don't really need it. So there you go, guys. That's how you can make a lot of XP in Minecraft Bedrock Edition. With a cool little hacky glitch cheat, if you want to call it, that not a lot of people know about. It's a lot more effective than just smelting normal stuff in an average furnace. So if you want to make lots of XP, well, this is how you do it. Alright guys, that's going to wrap up today's video. If you enjoyed this XP glitch, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Share this video with all your friends. Once again, if you have any problems, comment down below. And we'll do our best to help you. Uh, click subscribe to the channel so you never miss another upload. Hit post notifications. But with that being said, we hope you enjoy your allotted amount of XP. That doesn't even make sense. As long as you enjoy the video, that's all that counts. See you all next time. Goodbye, everybody.